Serenity here, who is very, she's a very decent person, and nothing against her at all. It says, people against the wells that defend this known pathological liar's every word truly concern me. If somebody was agreeing with everything Molly did, it should concern you. Molly's, well, I, I like Molly, she's a, a, a friend. But I don't agree with everything she does. And she doesn't agree with everything I do. But when you when you maximize by saying every word truly concerned me. Well, I don't agree with every word Marissa says. And she doesn't agree with every word I say. MGL absolutely does harass and torment victims' family members for content. Uh... We all know about the the one thing with the patches. After that, she she she's not tormenting a victim's family. She believes that Don and Candace Wells know something and aren't saying something, and she's standing on that. That's not harassment when she believes that. Now, you won't catch me in front of anybody's house with a bullhorn. You won't catch me going to anybody's job. I won't. I wouldn't do it that way. But she, Molly did, and she, she's suffering from backlash from that. But she's also uh, there's a lot of people that like that she went down there and did that more so than against it. And remember, these people that are calling out Molly for collecting money off of Summer Wells, in any other case, while they're calling her out, they are running their PayPal and Cash Apps down under to blow it. So what they're doing is they're making money by speaking about Summer Wells off a of tragedy, just like they're saying that Molly's doing it. If you want to speak out against Molly and how she's doing this, then turn your Cash App and your PayPal off. For that video. That's how you should do that. Honestly. Honestly. But it says. Before her harassment of. Missing children's devastated families. You should check out her well documented harassment of a rape victim. Now. She's talking about Melissa Schumann. Melissa Schumann was a member of the, the band Dream. And when she turned 18. She, had, she went back to a hotel with Nick Carter. Invited. She went in, she left a group of people that were sitting around in the living room because Nick had said, hey, come here, you know. So she went with him into his bathroom, bedroom area. They they had a sexual encounter. She went back out and party with those people again after that. And she didn't say anything for 10 years. She felt like he forced himself on her. She didn't say anything about it for 10 years. And in that 10 years... She still would be on his Instagram, talking about how much she cared. Hi, saying hi. And they even did a song together in that 10 years. 10 years later, she claimed that he forced himself on her. Nick was never charged. Nick denied it, and he was never charged. So, Melissa says that she was raped. Nick said that he didn't do that. Okay. So I'll go down to my response if it's still there. Okay. This is where I responded to Serenity here. And I'm not mad at her. I, I, I'm not going to respond to her aggressively. Melissa Schumann. Question mark. Nick Carter was never charged with anything. Yet you are here calling him a rapist. Just like Don and Candace haven't been charged with anything yet. Molly and those go at them. They say we allegedly know that Don and Candace didn't do anything. Wait a minute. The way we allegedly know that Don and Candace didn't do anything is because they weren't charged and they say they didn't do it. Nick says he didn't do it, anything to, to Melissa and he, has, he was, wasn't charged. So according to you, we have to believe that. You are doing... To Nick, what you complain is being done to the wells. I personally 
don't feel like uh, Melissa Schumann was raped by Nick Carter. I feel like she had a sexual encounter with Nick Carter. And she waited 10 years. You know, I'm, I, I, I tell you what. If I'm a rape victim, I'm not going to do a song for everybody to see with my rapist. If I'm a rape victim, in my opinion, I am going not to wait for 10 years to report. I'm not going to wait until my rapist's career starts getting a little bit bigger. And they start making a little more money. They start getting a little more popular to claim this. There's absolutely no proof that Melissa Schumann was molested by him at all, except for her word. That's all. 